You like the 96.9 Cool FM, your number one hit music station. You know, every Wednesday we throw we big and we always have the biggest of the biggest interviews with the biggest superstars. 17 minutes past, we're about to hit uh, 2 o'clock. It's almost, I mean, it's time for lunch for you guys. Make sure you eat healthy, right? I'm AKA Deal to the T. You want to hang out? Devlin with the beautiful one, Kemi Smalls. And we already had DJ on the show. Great conversation. It's the interviews of all interviews, right? If you want to be part of the show, tune in. Don't forget, at Cool FM Nigeria, we're number one. I uh, Get us online, ask the question, call us on our numbers as well. And you can also stream online at www.facebook.com forward slash cool FM 969, right? And you already know when it comes to music, we throw it out first. When it comes to biggest stars, we actually speak to them first. And when it comes to guys who break the boundaries, they come on the show as well. For anybody to get that seat, they deserve it. Three years down the line, I had an interview with this guy. Almost a time that he could not even say much. You know, things... Um, uh, possibly misjudged or, you know, a lot of guys said he lied. Some people say he didn't. All right, some thought, you know, the career was dead. His music wasn't popping at that time. It was signed to record label that, you know, at the end of the day, they all came in defending him. He was dumbfounded. He was very, very uh, downtrodden, like they say, right? And I just didn't think, you know, to be honest, I might have joined them because I felt in my mind, you know what? Does he have the big heart to break out of it? But he did. Three years down the line, ladies and gentlemen, he was not a guy. Nobody ever thought at any point we'd have a three singles back to back and they were all hits. I mean, I can remember the time I walked into, I mean, I went to London. People, oh, you did that interview for this guy with this guy. Was he lying? Was he not? I couldn't even tell people whether it was lying or not. But the fact is, where God is taking you is a different ball game. When God is with you is a different ball game. Well, confident, superstar in the making, everybody's going crazy for his music. He's actually joined the likes of the David Dose Whiskit, who will drop three singles back to back and become a hit. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm talking about the one and only superstar, house star dude. You already know it, holding it down. One of the biggest stars right now. I'm sure you cannot even believe this. I'm talking about Skibby. <laughs> Welcome to the show, bro. That's how I start doing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy to have you here. You know, yes, sir. uh, if we go back in time, bro, <laughs> I remember you were sitting on my, this, you were sitting here on yeah. my left, I think left hand, yeah. yeah. Casey, Casey was on was that there. seat here. Yeah. Harry Song was here. Yeah. And almost all the questions I asked you, you could not even answer a lot of it. Because, I mean, I know you don't want to talk about this, but let's go back as old times, right? Because now, <laughs> it's easy not to say things have gone on. I mean, you've popped already. Yeah. I mean... Do you still stick to that story that that really happened to you? Yeah, of course. Of course. So that's the truth. And um, I already told my fans, you know, they understand and they know what's up. They stick to that, you know, they stand with me. Yeah. And right now, you know, the story is different. Uh, so I'm happy, you know, thank God for everything. I had to just... I had to just forget it. I called myself in your Jesu and accept because people just no one hear me. But I just moved on, you know. I moved on and I'm doing me, like making that. my music, what, what, what? doing my style. I like know? that. I like that. I mean, what would you say? I mean, for anybody trying to get out of because I know this kind of thing led to depression. Yeah. People saying a lot about you, your career, how you know some people said that you know they compared your career to to death. People compared your career to things that were never going to rise. Yeah. How did you get out of that thing? And and what were the things you went through at that time? Because I know it was a really trying time for you. What I did was, I was down actually then. Then I picked up myself. I'm like, yo, you, you, you can't be like this now. You know the truth. Fight for it. And you can't, you can't keep explaining to people. You just keep working, move. You get me? So when I, when I go out, people, people still call me Lazarus and all that you get mm. me so I had to I changed my name to your Jesu you get so I'm like okay what's happen? do you get me since you guys don't want to I've, I've told you the truth you don't want to listen and you know Nigerians they want to pick what they want to pick I don't like, know forget but I'm a stunt okay you believe you believe in a stunt oh, okay no wala and I moved on you get me so me I don't now, the same I people, don't have time and the same people now the bad people used to say so me i don't listen to people i focus on the on the music 
and myself. That's it. That's what I do. And that's how I do. Like I do. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, like you say, the story has really changed. I like I like the direction because uh, you are a revelation. Uh, I've been there. I've done that. I've seen it. And looking at you right now, and I'm like, bro, three hit singles. That's no nobody. We. I mean, just a few guys have done that. Three hit nice. singles back to back. Now, sometimes you go back home and think, wow. Was this ever? Did you ever see this coming? I swear, I saw it. I saw it from. I was ready. I was ready for everything. Man. I was ready. You know. That's how I started. You have to believe. You have to. You have to know that you are a dawn. Because you know what you have. You know you are bad. You know what I. What I feel is that people don't. People don't know what I'm capable of. They don't see the beauty in my talent. You hmm. understand? The more bangers come in, sir. So. Hmm. Now them saying I eat me, I don't know saying I eat it. Because <laughs> me, I'm just doing my thing. I'm just doing music, making music and dropping yeah. them. And I'm about to drop more, so. You get me? Uh, which song would you tell, I mean, so far now, st- uh, that's how Stardew is going bigger. Yeah, now. yeah. Would you say, which of your songs, Sensima or st- that's how, st- which one do you think is bigger? <laughs> Sensima, of course. That was the biggest break <laughs> for Sensima is like 14 million views right now. You know, Sensima is, they are playing Sensima in American radio, and I'm not even there. You understand? I don't want to mention names. Some guys called me. You understand? My yeah. colleague, that's Ogbeni, we will they promote for this side. You, your song, they just they play you for here like this. <laughs> or when you get local, <laughs> now Grace. I understand what you mean. So, uh, that song is, that song is mad. You see, that's I have what? a good relationship with Casey. I know, but more with Harry Song. Uh, do you still have a good relation with Casey? And yes, see, see my last message on Instagram. Oh, Casey, wow. you see that? Wow. wow, with everybody, I'm cool with everybody. That's how Star do. Star don't fight nobody. You understand? Star don't talk too much. Star <laughs> keep it cool. I like that. Always put your money where your mouth is. I like that. Yeah. Now, uh, l- looking at your your growth and then, uh, I mean, what you become now. I mean, um, are you ever gonna think of even putting all the people on? Because now. Would you, would you, who would you owe your growth to? I mean, apart from God, who would you hold your growth to? I mean, you get into this place, who do you owe it to? God. Apart from God. God and me. I swear. You, you, you don't think and... anybody helped anything? You did this yourself. A lot of people helped me. Man. You know, people that are playing my song, they helped me. Man. You know, people that signed me before said, nobody knew me. You mm. get me? Everybody, a lot of people helped me, but. I was to say, Skibi, thank you so much. God bless you. <laughs> I like this guy. I swear, because I, I honestly, I know, I know how you, I, I know that feeling, because you no, know, the truth is, people don't see you're different, uh, and people might judge based on what they feel. And I think yeah. even with my case, it happens to me a lot of times. But I'm like, I know where I'm going to. I know who I am. I don't need your validation, that's the most you know, and I, and I think that's 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 what everybody should do. I mean, believe in that fact that you know what. Some will tell you, you know, I need security. Some will tell you, oh, I need money. Or some will say, you know, I have a godfather somewhere who can help me. I, I'm not the kind of guy who believes in those kind of things. It happens. It's good. It's good. Yeah. If it comes, it comes. But I feel the biggest, the biggest uh, gift you can ever have is yourself, and yeah. know where you're going to, and know who you are. That's yeah. it. That's the biggest gift. You, if you if you're aware of who you are. I know what you. I think your story is a revelation. I mean, I'll be honest. I'll be honest. If I want to be honest, I never saw this coming. You have proven yourself beyond doubt, and you're a superstar. I can guarantee Thank that. It is not. This is not a child's play. I know. Shout out to Lax of Alami Day. He always puts. You know, at the time people kept asking questions. Alami, you always talk about this guy. Because I'll be honest. Yeah. Alami, just you know what? There was a time he, he called you, but did a song with you. Yeah, yeah. I think he just always that. Uh, he felt something was right about you. Yeah, even in the song, he said it. They say, you know, go blow, Abby. Yeah. This life is so funny, you know. That song, eh? <laughs> and you know what? I'm going to play that song right now. I do. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll give you the man. remix. Skibi's on this one. Oh, he featured the Lamy on it. And one of the guys who ever, ever, I mean, people always ask him questions, why? But now you know why. We'll be right back in the show. That's how. Hero 96.9, Cool FM. The irony of that song is everything you heard him say on that song. 
Eyes happen now. I mean, uh, sometimes it put your money where your mouth is and decrease certain things in your life. You know, when you have to do certain things in your life, yeah. speak it to yourself. And then what happen? If it's worth it, fine. If it's, if it's not, if you curse yourself, shout out to you. And if you pray for yourself, that's exactly what's going to happen to you. Yes, Every sir. single thing said on that song is what has happened in his life right now. Skibby. Nice. Buzz. <laughs> <laughs> you know the good thing about you now, you just leave life. I see you on your Insta story sometimes, just laugh that it just leaves the life. Like, it's not even worried about anything. And this is how Star, that's how Star do. Yeah. I heard you started somewhere in the north. You went for a show. Yeah. You got out of the car and you just said that. And since then, it just stuck. <laughs> is that true? The, um, I think I that was, was the first time the video went viral. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the first one. That was the first one. But. I was I was having a chat with Maestro. Okay. Then he said, "You, you just the, you just the, you the chop outside. See, as you just the chop, you just the do like that." So that's how I start do. He said, "Ah, how does that do?" I said, "Like I do." <laughs> so me, I even forgot about that. That's how I start do. Then when he came to my house the next day, then he said, "Eh, hey, that's how I start do, Abi. Like I do, you know." Then I remember that I said this thing last night. So from there, I started saying, it. Yeah. "That's how I start do. That's how I start do on Instagram." Before I make it a jam, they make it a hit. And oh. Call Tanny and Files on it. You understand? And, and, they, and it. they dropped the verse. Whose okay. verse do you like the most, honestly? Apart from your verse. First, apart from Skippy's verse. At first, I, I love Tanny's verse. Yeah. But now, now Files. Files, <laughs> uh, he's just funny somehow. It's crazy. I like <laughs> Tanny's verse too. I mean, uh, that, that, yeah. they, you know, the thing is, they all compliment each other. Like, you can like it. It, there's a parties you hear Fowles' part, it mm -hmm. just fits in. Like, I would like to hear Fowles' part in a club. Tenny, I like to hear Tenny's part when I'm in driving in the car, I'm um, just partying there yeah. somewhere. But in a club, <laughs> I like to hear Fowles' part. He just makes you feel like, you know what, I own a table, I can buy the bar, you know, I'm the, I'm the <laughs> it's crazy. So everything has a feel. And your verse, too, you know, it just felt like, I like your verse. It's like you just compliment. You brought both parties together and yeah. just held it together. It, yeah. it just makes sense. Yeah, because when I before I put Files and Tenny on the song, I was thinking like, yo, Tenny's on serious person. Files too. Jonesa, even Misef, Ali Chris. So, <laughs> you know, coming together on that jam is just, we're just playing. It's just a vibe. You know, that's, yeah. the, that's the type like of song. I like that. I like that. As I started. What was the worst comment anybody ever made to you? The worst comment? Somebody that it really hits you. Oh my, I can't even remember because I don't pay attention to those things. Wow. I swear, I can't remember. <laughs> because I don't hear plenty. Pl uh, plenty. Plenty. Especially that time. Yeah. Hey. hey every day, bad, bad comments. No good comments. <laughs> I swear. Kai. You know, I, I can almost connect your story to even Tune and the story as well. You know, Tune came out with a banging song, Catching Cold. He was hot. And he, he had a good run until he did a video that he did in a bathtub and everybody just crucified the guy. You know, there was a time he did a video or a song he was in a bathtub. You remember that People song? Were coming out of they the came sand. out. Now, everybody now is Tony Edna's friend. Somehow, yeah. everybody goes on his page, <laughs> comments. To be honest, I think that's the only guy that you have the most celebrities coming on is his page. Everybody's coming. You just see blue ticks everywhere. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> So sometimes I like to, I I I, I actually, I, I mess with success stories. I mean, people that you knew, you knew that were there at some point, they didn't pick up, or people just uh, condemned them and they just rose and got to where they are. It's a big deal. It is a big deal. Three years down the line, Kimmy Smalls, and the story is different. Now it's different. It's Kimmy, three years now. Were well, you under any pressure after Sensima? No. Like, oh my goodness, I have to do like a proper follow-up song to this and people are expecting so much. No, I, I wasn't expecting anything. I mean, I'm just dropping my songs. Mm -hmm. Even that's how I start do. Mm -hmm. People were telling me I shouldn't drop the song that is hip-hop. I asked like four DJs. They told me like, oh man, we don't know how we want to mix this song. We don't know what song to mix. That's how I start do it. Don't drop the song. I still drop the song. Why did you drop it after all that? Because well? I like it. Yeah, I'm yeah. just dropping whatever I like. I'm just <laughs> making the music God. and dropping them. God. And and that's it. You got to love what you do. And you got to love it. You just got to love it. You got to love it. I mean, it's a pleasure having you on the show. Always. Yes, I don't feel like I have it. I feel like you just spend time exalting you because I, I think <laughs> you've been in all of it because I still have that bitch. It's still in my mind. 
It is still in my mind. It is crazy. What's in Yo, your mind? Pe- people like you, people like you inspire me, you know. Thank Back you. then it's so late. Like, yeah. <laughs> and you always see these bros go carry bag. Every day, bike, bam, go enter streets. The next thing I see him for video, um, the band, <laughs> they dance. And they tell people, say, nah, that guy, crazy. that my bros, be that too. They crazy. My area. crazy. You get me? Yeah. So, uh, if people like that, if you make them from that side, uh, we too, True. we make them now. True. We actually so, lived in Ijesa at that time. Yeah. Me, myself, and John Ogu, the footballer. I used to see John play football then, you know. Uh, he was in, on the other streets, and I didn't even know he, he was there. And he, until he told me, I said, Baba, I live for this place. Now, yeah, you just carry bike every time. And it's true. I'm always going to backpack, came here and trying to get to radio. Sometimes I stop by the way when I don't have money, I jump on another, I walk. I think that you should. And um, is crazy. I, I feel like people need to tell their stories. Ah, you know what I'm saying? Like, if from I tell my own, coming, yeah, yeah, I feel like you should. <laughs> so that, like, yeah. other people can be inspired because yeah. some people think that you just came from nowhere and i'm not even just talking you yeah. generally i'm just talking they see you and they're like oh where did you just come from but they don't understand that there was like a lot of work behind the scenes and like i said earlier nigerians you say it was god and really psh, okay no. god then what else <laughs> you know what i mean yeah. so i think that we need to tell our stories more so that we can inspire the people that are coming up to see yeah, that sure. it's possible it is you possible know? ah so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so Kenny, sometimes you just don't want to talk. I yeah. Mean, I, I I think I want to. I want mine. I'm gonna re- put my own in the video. You should write a story. You should write a book, bro. I mean, should I give you the title for it? <laughs> dead once, <laughs> or dead alive, dead or alive. <laughs> Mad. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. My album is coming. Yeah. <laughs> the album's coming. Yes. When? So end of this year or ah. early next year do you have a name ah, don't worry i just gave you Secrets. one dead ones no don't worry so don't the worry. album you name is it. a secret <laughs> i don't love don't worry, it's, it's don't even, can we know the funny love thing it, it's ripe it. for even an album because yeah, once you time. drop three singles and they're all hits mm-hmm, that's, that's right. it you're ripe for an album mm-hmm. three singles hot hit that's it i mean that's a benchmark shout out to light whiskey the band two-faced just a few i mean david doe they did it you know three singles bah, 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 bah. you're good you ready for an album? Yeah, no. It's coming. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we'll be right back in the show, guys, and we'll wrap this part of the show up. You want to talk to Skeevy? Numbers are 271 0969 and 271 That's Relax how I start doing. Do. You're 96.9. Hello, how are you doing? Uh, Baba. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What is your name? Hey, is that your name? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is your name? What is, they, what is your name? Okay, is okay. I'm a star now. So, excuse me. I found out. When that thing happened, I'm one of those so who didn't like it. And uh, one of those guys that time, he was like, hey, this guy did a stunt. My dad was... In the long run, I didn't feel your songs, and I was like, this guy no people who carry, but to be frank with you, these songs, man, since you released this, has been on repeat. Anytime I just play it, I don't listen to it on, I listen to it so many times. So yeah. I know those books like, well, 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 I know the first side and your shit, own is shit, so shit. I'm like, yeah, I'm not a fan. That's where I'm going to. Bless when up, you started, up, man, I was brother. I was like, this guy no keep blue. But now I see you blue. And you should keep it up. Yeah, you are a star already, so keep it up. Bless you, man. Nice one. Thank you. Okay, you want to talk to Skibi numbers are 27 1 one three nine six nine. Hello. 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 Josh, shout out to you. You know what you did, right? Don't mind you. Uh-uh. What you caught Don't mind you. Hello, how are you doing? Hey. Welcome to the show. See you to the show. You already know. Welcome to the show. Yeah. It's nice to be able to talk to you. And I want to say that uh, I really appreciate what he's doing. Uh, Skibi. Oh, shit? Yeah, I just want to say I'm from small London, Cheetah. 
Oshie oh. Adugbo. Oh. Ah, I want to say song. that uh, we were really, really scared the time we pulled out stuff, man. So all the same, happy for you. Bless Thank up. you. Bless all up. the best. Uh, uh, Oshie, keep nice up being a star, man. Nice one. Thank Hello. you. Hello. Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Mm. Hey, TV. Say hey, hey, baby. Stevie. What's going on? <laughs> What's up? <clears throat> I'm a huge fan. Like, a huge fan. Man, thank and I'm, you, I'm, man. Like, I'm listening and I'm hearing people calling to give words of a comment. I'm like, where were you then? Like, seriously, but... I'm a huge fan. I mean, when I first heard him, I was like, whoa. You could call us back because we're about to wrap this up. We could call us back. All right. Hello. How are you doing? Hello. Hello. Welcome to the show. What is your name? Yeah, Lico. Lico, hi. How are you? Yeah, I'm fine. Good afternoon. Good afternoon to you. Skibby's here. Yeah. What did you say? You want to talk to Skibby or you just want to say hi? Yeah, I just want to say hi. I just want to say hi. Yeah, bless up, man. Look also. Nice one. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. Everything nice. I'll skip it tomorrow, come on. What's it going on? Okay, so okay. Okay. I just want to say hi. I'm going to fear. If you don't catch me. I said you you have your guy voice. All right, okay. I think it's a rap on the show, right? It Can is we? a rap on the show. <laughs> it's a rap. It's a rap. Skibby. Yes, so thanks Skibby, for having Skibby. me, man. <laughs> Kevin Smalls. <laughs> Abomi, you know how we do it. Another song I, I love is Ogume. Ogume I Day. think, you know, he's had, he has a, a lot of great songs. Yeah. You, a lot. Let me just explain something to you. Yeah. My favorite song is Gara. Really? Yeah. Like it's about, ever, about Surulere. Ever. Hmm. It's my story. Anything you need to know about me is inside the song. Gara. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to play that. I'm going to play that. Sure you, know, you know what's funny is, Nigel is, you can do good music. Mm-hmm. Once one blows up, they're going to look for the other ones. The other ones, yes. It's guaranteed. That's so right. it's even easy for people like him because he has a catalog of songs to perform. It's a Gume. Gume is he's a good song. Mm. Ah, Skibi is a good London. song. London. London is a good song, yeah. you know, but... Now, every, the other ones are yeah. blown, so everybody's going to dig out the other songs. <laughs> it's like that. It's like, that's how we do it. That's how we do it in Nigeria. That's how stars do it in Nigeria. <laughs> you, know, you know what's interesting? That That's how Sadu's song is so weird, but he's so nice. Yeah. Like, there's just something weird about the song. Dun, 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 the old school. Yeah. You know? Well, it's so nice. Dun, 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 and the bounce, actually. Files and Tenny. Did you, when you had the idea of the song, did you think Files and Tenny? Or did yes, that no, just happen? Like I said, I was thinking... If you just they play for this song, ten and fouls, you know. When, when, when? When, 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 when you see a star. And then, you know, I'm going to give my shako. <laughs> I dash you. That's my, <laughs> that part, so it kills me. Uh, it's going to be happy for you, man. Thank, thank you so you, much for coming you, on the show. Much, Always a pleasure. Much, Keep working much. hard. Looking out for you. More work. More work. Keep working. We'll look out for the yes, album sir. this year. Dropping anytime this year, December or. Like November. November, probably. actually. So, yeah. expect an album from uh, Skibby. We did. Back to the show. Shout out to everybody who popped in. Big A, uh, DJ, and we had Skibby right here as well. So, uh, you know, look out for the interview online. You know, more inspiration. You can get more from it. It's, it's interviews of all interviews. Mm-hmm. On Superstar Wednesday, we'll be right back. I'm still dealing with the TUN. I got Kami yeah, Smalls, Smalls, Smalls on it. And this one is Gara. <laughs> um, <laughs> 